at this point, these are kind of like my weekly phone call from prison. That's right, it's the Brickhead Gauntlet, I believe around number 52, Elsa from Disney. Um, reasonable design. Uh, the, the, the cape is pretty, pretty standard. Um, this is kind of a fun pattern for her dress top or, or, or blouse top. I don't know what you call it. Uh, the, the obvious big detail is the little sexy dress slit here where her leg is sticking out. Oh, look, her eyes a little crooked. <laughs> Oops. I will say is that the, the only thing about this one that makes me not, uh, love it, like, I don't know. What would you do? What would you do to make this skin a little more pale? Uh, because she looks very, um, like the, her very white skin and her very light blonde hair are kind of her trademark. So you've got, I think that's an okay color, the cool, the cool yellow color for her hair, but, uh, her skin definitely feels dark, which makes her look sunburned, which is kind of awkward. Um, no other special prints on this one. It's one of these blank bases because we're way past printed bases at this point. Underneath, it's kind of weird because like it's a full solid thing basically, except for that, which is a little, bit of snot there. Can you see it? Um, but like she sits on the base like a normal one. Uh, in fact, she doesn't even extend out with her cape and everything. It doesn't extend out past the boundaries of the normal one. Uh, so actually, I think she's a really good display figure for that. Her hair is a little bit annoying, but it's very swooshed back and I like the uh, the effect there and the little braid wrapping down over her shoulder. It's a very iconic uh, piece. Is that falling down? Well, that's just how it's going to be. Um, yeah, this one sits on a little bit lower shelf for me, so it's a little bit dirtier than some of the other ones. But uh, overall, uh, that's a very reasonable Brickheads. I don't know if we'll ever get another Elsa, honestly, unless they make it another movie, maybe. I don't know. Maybe they'll do like a greatest hits of Brickheads and they'll just do all of the, the big ones again. And uh, hopefully they'll have the same number, but knowing Lego, they'll reissue them with a new number and I'll have to recollect them, even though they've got 99% the exact same build. Anyways, that's it from me. I'm Pro Lego Channel, and you've just watched another Brickheads Gauntlet video, um, the weekly series where I review all the Brickheads in order so that I can ascend to Brickheads Valhalla. Anyways, automatic video over here. Subscribe on Elsa. If you're not a subscriber, what are you doing? And then over here in the void is a video that I handpicked for you, my sweet, sweet ancient fan of Lego. And remember to always support your local Lego channel. Bye.